My biggest tip on using the power of words is one that I don't always remember to take myself, which is always read the words you write aloud. Uh, when I was in journalism school, we were split between print and broadcast reporting students. And I remember being struck by the broadcast students having to read everything aloud. Obviously, they were testing copy for the nightly news, and they wanted to make sure this would come out right out of the anchor's mouth. But the truth is that's as important to print writers. You know, earlier we were discussing the tendency of people who focus on one topic to not see the forest for the trees because they're experts and start throwing in all this data that might not be important to readers. Reading it aloud helps cut that out and helps kind of hone the power of your words. So I'll, if I have time, which is not every day, read a story to myself, because the readers are reading it, you're reading it when you pick up the newspaper, and you don't want a sentence that is mealy mouth like you're in a college textbook. So oftentimes and then I'll just slash a lot of information out of it, which I think is important, but it just ruins the read. It's, it's gotta be simple.